What's happening, man? All right, listen. I don't know if any of y'all watch it. Because I don't, I don't watch too many shows, but I gave this show a chance and I've been watching it. All right? Bates Motel. Do y'all watch this? Because it's one of the only shows that I do catch besides Flash and WWE and shit. Um, <laughs> if anyone don't know what Bates Motel is, it's about the young Norman Bates. You know, psycho? It's about him. And it's like it's telling you how he becomes the Norman Bates that we all know about. So he's a teenager. His name is Norman. His mom's name is Norma. He has this, like, James Dean biker-type big brother. It's kind of cool, you know, the badass type, you know, and there's a cool sheriff in town. And there's, like, all this crazy shit that goes on in town with drugs and weed and, you know, but... As you like, <laughs> the series like I'm hooked on it, but it 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 it, <laughs> it puts me in a weird spot. It makes me feel you uh, sometimes because like he's already killed a few people. He's got this whole it's spoilers. Uh, he's already got he's got an issue where he blacks out when he gets really angry or stressed out, and he actually killed his father, uh, protecting his mother. And throughout the series, things happen where he blacks out. A teacher tried to seduce him. He blacked out. He ended up killing her, slitting her throat. Um, he ended up killing a, a, a hooker, a high price hooker at that. Um, and what you find is that um, when he blacks out, his, he has a split personality inside him, another personality inside him, which is his mother. But she's, like, sinister. She's not like the way his mom, Norma, is actually in the series. She's almost like his feeling, his representation of how... It's almost like how he views her, in a way, you know? Like, very overprotective, and don't do that, and don't do this, and she's not the right girl for you. So it kind of pitches back to the movies when you watch the movies, and you know, you mess with those dirty girls, and Norman, you know? Like, and you find out later on that he has split personality. He dresses up as his mom, and he kills people. That's in the movies, though. But now, it's like, it's just now really starting to come out, and and... When I used to watch, when I was watching it, I first started watching it with an ex-girlfriend, and I'd be like, yo, man, I really don't fucking like this relationship between him and his mom. They are too fucking close. They sleep in the bed, bed together sometimes. She just hugged the way, just the way she touches him sometimes. And you can tell she's not trying to be sexual, but you can see what effect that it's having on him. So here we get to this episode. Last episode, her mom, his mom started messing with the psychiatrist. Psychiatrist was sent to talk to him by the mom. And the mom said, look, I mean, the psychiatrist asked him a few questions. He started getting mad and jealous. Like, he don't like when anyone talks to his mom, hangs around his mom, dates his mom. And he asked him, he's point blank. He said, do you want to sleep with your mom? And Norman was choking the shit out of him, scared him out of the house. I don't know how his skinny, lanky ass did that, because this was a grown-ass man, but he scared him out of the house. And at the end, you can see him, while she's sleeping, he's stroking her thigh. Now, truth be told, okay, I will bust Norma Bates' ass. Now, if that actress is single, <clears throat> she like young chocolate, give him my, you know, give him my... My channel and my, my cell phone. But anyway, listen. So, in this episode, okay. <laughs> I'm like, this thing is crazy. It really does want to fuck his mom. That's why they got all those mom sections. You look at porn, they got mom pornos out there. Mom and son shit. Fuck that. I ain't into that shit. But apparently, some dudes out there want... They have this fetish, they have this in their mind, and they want to fuck their mom. But listen, so I'm in it right now, right? And the mom wakes up in the morning, and there's some um, construction going on outside of the base motel. Y'all got to watch it to understand what's going on. She's bending over to look out the window, and she's like, what is going on here? And he's looking at her ass like, I have no idea, mother. And he calls her mother. All the time, mother, mother's never mom. Never, he's 
man is disturbed. By the way, he's actually had a chance to fuck a few fine-ass girls in here, which would never happen with a dude that looks like that in real life. But anyway, I'm telling you, Magnus Sykes, if you do not watch this, you got to catch up on it. Bates Motel, I think they're all on Netflix. But I'm watching it right now because I got it recorded. And, um, yeah, I, I, I was watching um, Orange is the New Black. But I stopped. I got I got to finish that up too. Uh, I know y'all always want me to check out all these other things like uh, 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 Walking Dead. I'm zombied out, so that's why I don't watch that. And uh, there's another one. Uh, What's that? Game of Thrones. I don't watch that either. Uh, it's just it's just I'm not, I've never been in the King Arthur and medieval time. Medieval time. Yeah, I've never been into that. I just haven't been into it. Um, there's another one too. Who's the one with the guy that uh, sells the drugs? You got the glasses, older white dude, got the mustache. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, I know I don't watch that either. I tried watching it. I tried giving it a chance a few times, but anyway. Post the comments down below and let me know what you think. But I had to stop it and I had to do this video. Because <laughs> y'all don't know that I watch it. I don't even know if y'all know about it. The shit's fucking good as far as I'm concerned, all right? Post the comments down below and let me know what you think. One million subscribers. Woo!